like to begin tonight with the story of the three recaptured escapees from committee prison who are tonight back at the maximum correctional facility. The trio were arrested in Kitui County earlier today as they tried to make their way to Somalia. The three, Musharraf Abdallah, alias Alex Shikanda, Joseph Juma Odhiambo and Muhammad Ali Abikar were flown back to Nairobi following an intelligence-led operation that followed a tip-off from members of the public. Hassan Mugambi reports on the dramatic touchdown of the three terror convicts and what awaits them. The National Police Service helicopter ferrying the three terror convicts recaptured at the border of Kitui and Tana River counties touched down Thursday afternoon at the committee maximum prison. One by one, the frail-looking convicts were escorted into a standby vehicle. The first blindfolded convict, Joseph Juma Odiambo, also known as Yusuf, was immediately bundled into a standby vehicle. Then followed Musharraf Abdullah alias Alex Shikanda, seemingly too frail to walk on his own. A third, Mohammed Ali Abikar, who is believed to have been the master planner who was leading the trio into Somalia, also in blindfold, was thrown into the standby vehicle. With speed, they were then driven back to the very facility they escaped from in such mysterious fashion just three days ago. Interior Cabinet Secretary Fred Martiangi praised the multi-agency team bringing together the National Intelligence, the Crime Research and Investigations Bureau and the Anti-Terror Police Unit of the DCI, terming the escape a vital lesson learned. That there are certain lapses that we need to deal with. We have spent the last three days working on you know, how to deal with some of those challenges. The CS announced that going forward, the Ministry of ICT will take charge of the installation of security surveillance equipment at the prisons and all other vital installations. Fellow Kenyans, you may be inconvenienced, but we are not uh, you know, in a normal space at the moment. We have raised the level of alert. Let us all be very careful about what we do around here. Sources privy to the multi-agency team trailing the terror convicts revealed to Citizen TV that the trio, who were facilitated with a GPRS device, escaped on foot and were arrested after covering 100 kilometers at Endau area of Mwingi East along the Tana River Kitui County borders. They had walked in a straight line eastwards, aiming to get to Somalia. It is believed that they had been walking at night and resting during the day. The convicts currently at the committee maximum prison are expected to be interrogated and presented before court to be charged with escaping lawful custody. If found guilty, their sentence will be added to their current jail term as terrorism convicts. Even as the recapture of the trio comes in as a reprieve to the security forces in the country, that were under constant pressure to produce them, it opens up the need to ensure investment in the security of such facilities to ensure such an incident does not occur. Hassan Mugambi, Citizen TV.